Hey there, scrappers. This is Marcy Ava Worrell, your local creative partner with Kiwi Lane. Today, I just wanted to do a really quick video on how I store my Kiwi Lane template. So in this first box is how I store my a la carte. Now we do carry not only the large storage box that I have these in, but also the little sort of folders here as well. And you'll notice on my a la cartes, um, I have different sizes and you'll see that in a second, but I have them all marked. I do have all of them with the title so that not only can I remember what they are, but also I can remember where to put them back. Now, most of our items, our templates will have the name. So you'll see it says a la carte love at home. So it's kind of easy to know what they are, but just in case that ever was to wear off or you know, get scratched off or something like that, I know what they are. And I can definitely see them from afar when I need to pull them out of the box. So that is uh, like one of them. And then another one, for instance, um, has this next set. And you'll see um, like this one again, has each of the items and it has them in there and then has the label. Um, and I do have just about all of the a la carte. Um, I have been a Kiwi Lane fan for many, many years. And so I have just about all the templates, I'm just gonna sit this down, just about all the templates that have ever been made, right? So I have the um, just about all the templates, just about all of the borders. Um, and this one is my borders box. And you'll see it's labeled there. And I have mine for these in alphabetical order. So it kind of starts off with Abbey Road and then Aspen Court and then Cedar Trails and Chevron and so forth. And you'll see, you know, like I said, I pretty much have just about all of them. There's maybe one or two that are missing, um, but for the most part, I have them all. In the back of this box though, you'll notice I do have them slightly stored differently. These are um, our smaller borders that are mostly used for card making, but you definitely can move, use them for more than just cards. You can use them on uh, your other items items as well. Um, and so like your scrapbooking pages, but those I have in the back. Now I do not have all of those just because I chose not to purchase them all. Um, but I have right many of those as well. And then lastly is my accessories box and my accessories box. You will notice for most of them, I kept the paper inserts and kept them inside their packaging. And I did that just because many of them have small pieces and I didn't want them to accidentally um, get misplaced. So you'll see while they are in here and they are still in those nice little sleeves that we sell um, with Kiwi Lane, they are still in their packaging as well, but I do also still have them labeled so I know where to put them back and whatnot. These, uh, for the most part, I tried to keep them together. So you'll see like nature and then tiny nature. Um, I tried to, even if they don't have a set from both piece, um, from tiny and I guess regular size, I tried to put themes together. So like this one was Halloween and this one is autumn. And this is one of the few that I took out of the paper because the pieces weren't as small. These are, you know, kind of large pieces. Like here's one of the pumpkins. Um, so I didn't want to take them apart. Okay. So I hope this was helpful just to kind of give you a snapshot. Like I said, of how I store my templates, um, that are of the, what I call the smaller variety in these three storages. And to kind of give you an idea, like I said, I have almost every template that we've had and I am able to store them in just three. I didn't have to invest in many, many, many. Now I could probably do like one more. Um, if I get a few more borders, um, or more borders, you know, come out and I add those to my collection, I probably will need one more of those and probably one more accessories if I get too many more of those. Um, one thing to make note, I do not have any of the templates that come in the Kiwi Lane um, Kiwi Club, those I keep with the paper. I keep them as a complete set, as a kit. And I actually am gonna show a video on that as well because I get a lot of people that ask me how I store those. So I will share that also. So I hope this was helpful. If you're thinking about getting these as storage units, I would highly suggest it. Um, it is just a small investment to keep yourself organized and it makes scrapbooking for me so much easier. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Thanks and have a great day. Bye-bye.